guys welcome back to another video in today's video we are in adopt me as you guys can see and if we look right over to the left side of the screen we can see something that says ocean egg which releases in six days adopt me just uploaded a video trailer of the ocean egg this morning so in today's video we are going to be reacting to that as well as showing you guys if you guys have not seen that already so if you guys would like to see that then make sure to hit that subscribe button and let's go ahead and and get into the video. Alright guys, so we've made our way over to YouTube and I'm actually not going to play the music in this video today because I don't know for sure if it's going to be copyrighted. I'll leave a link to this video down below in the description box in case you guys wanted to watch it with sound, but let's go ahead and play it. I am so excited. So we start off underwater and look at this. They made it look like Adopt Me was kind of like underwater for a second. How cool. Oh my gosh, what is that? Is that like coral or something? Oh, the ocean egg, guys. I'm so excited. Oh my gosh. Okay, so I see a bunch of coral. I see like a starfish. It looks like they revamped the map ocean egg in eight days. So it's probably shorter than that. But oh my gosh, look at this. The countdown starts now! Oh my goodness! Okay, so I'm kind of curious what kind of pets are going to be in this ocean egg. We've already seen some pets like the shark. We've also seen the crab as well. Oh my gosh, so wait, there's going to be a shark in the water? Okay, so we've seen this pet right here on Twitter already. If you guys haven't seen the clip, I will insert right now. Alright guys, so I switched over to Twitter for a second, but this is the tweet that they posted with the crab just going back and forth so this is probably what its animations are going to be when it is walking all right so back to the video ocean egg starts in eight days friday april 16th fossil eggs will be replaced by the ocean eggs oh my goodness guys wow but i just now got back into playing adopt me so i'm really excited to see a new egg launch i haven't really been here for an adopt me egg launch so this is pretty new to me and this is probably like my first egg launch. I really wish I was there for the fossil egg but that's when I got really into like Overlook Bay and stuff but let's go ahead and play this video a little bit more. Oh my gosh wait hold on a second. Oh my gosh guys look at the starfish pet. It is flying with wings and we also have the crab flying with wings right there as well. Oh my gosh how cute. Oh my gosh look at the little seahorse pet guys. Oh my gosh how cute. Okay so a lot of people are saying that the ocean pet is the very first animated egg. Let's go ahead and go back to Twitter for a second. All right, so we are back on Twitter on the Adopt Me Twitter page. Um, this was from the last update with the container home. Okay, so this is a sneak peek that we got of the shark pit. Of course, it's really hard to tell in nature, but sharks can perfectly camouflage themselves with concrete. Okay, so this is a shark pet that we've seen in the video, and I'm really amazed of how this turned out. Like, I didn't think that Adopt Me would do ocean pets just because, like, with ocean pets, usually these animals are supposed to survive underwater, but we are above air this time and we're using our imaginations to have our pets live but this is the shark pet right here and I'm actually really excited for the seahorse pet a lot of people didn't think there was going to be a seahorse pet but there is and it's super cute okay so we've seen three pets so far I believe so like the shark pet we've also seen the crab pet as well and then also the seahorse pet that we've seen in this video guys okay so if we scroll all the way down to when we first seen the ocean egg leak all right so this right here is the very first leak we got of the adopt me ocean egg and as you guys can see the ocean egg is animated and a lot of people are saying like this is the very first animated egg which i'm really excited for i thought all the eggs were animated in some sort but i think this one's different because this one's actually jumping the other ones kind of just rocked back and forth if you remember from the past several eggs and then this one has like a little starfish just bobbing back and forth on it <laughs> that poor starfish oh my gosh it's probably the starfish pet that we can get in our login rewards all right so that is all the tea that i have today for the ocean egg update but i kind of wanted to show you guys how close i am to getting 
getting that uh, starfish pet. Okay, so the other day I recently just received the toucan pet. I currently have 401 stars, but um, I feel like I gained these pretty fast for some reason. I don't know because I, I legit just gained the blue rider like a couple weeks ago and then I also got the dig did Digerado Rito, I don't know how to say that. The This little um, instrument right here and then also the toucan. Um, all right, so I wanna show you guys my login streak before the countdown, but I am currently on 32 days. I thought that I might just talk about my login streak in my videos just to act as like a little stepping stone, I guess, or like, I don't even know, like a, like a little milestone or something. My biggest login streak was 67 days and I hope to get to 100 at least this time. All right guys, so let's go ahead Ahead and press on this the sea level is rising get fossil eggs before they're replaced so there isn't actually a countdown I don't think so or maybe it's outside wait let's go ahead and go outside and see if there is an actual countdown above us oh wait there is oh my gosh okay 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 I didn't think that this was gonna be here I thought this was just here for the video but as we can see we can see the starfish the crab flying ocean egg in six days oh my gosh guys go save up your adopt me cash okay so around the adoption center there is a bunch of like coral reefs and like seaweed and this is like this is so cool honestly this kind of scares me a little bit just because i don't like holes i have like a phobia against like holes and stuff like that maybe that's why a lot of people don't like seafood or eating sushi i love sushi by the way but things like this scare me okay i don't like the way that looks okay so we have a starfish back there we have some coral in the front i also see some starfish towards the top as well as some more coral and stuff and then more starfish and coral on this side as well that is so cool how they made this look like it's underwater and stuff like that let's go ahead and go inside the adoption center because i want to show you something that i noticed this morning so if we go all the way over to the fossil egg machine we can see that the next egg says ocean eggs so before it had like a bunch of question marks and stuff like that and guys, you want to make sure that you are picking up all of your fossil eggs before they leave. And guys, I have not received a dodo or a T-Rex. Actually, I did trade for a T-Rex and then I ended up trading my T-Rex away for a golden ladybug because I am actually working on a neon golden ladybug, as you guys can see. But I don't have any of the legendary um, dinosaur pets. I still need one more Deinonychus to make a neon. And then also if we go all the way down here, I believe I have like enough of every pet. So I have enough Dilophosaurus to make a neon. We also have a woolly man. My friend actually gave that to me, so thank you, Jello, for that. Um, I also have my very own Neon Glyptodon, Gemma, and then I also traded a Ladybug for just a rideable regular one. I was hoping to make like a Mega Neon, but I don't think I have time for that. We also have some Stegosauruses. Oh my gosh, guys, I need to get on this. I need to get four of each pet before they go. Um, this is Cinnamon right here, who is a ground sloth, and he is so cute. Let's pick him up. Oh my gosh, he is so cute. Okay. Okay, so this actually came from my friend to Jello. He went ahead and made this ground sloth cinnamon a neon. So I thank him for that. Um, I really like the ground stuff. I think it's super cool. I didn't think I was going to get it, although it is a common. I didn't think I was going to get it. And then we also have a few Tasmanian tigers. I need one more to make a neon. Before the ocean egg update comes, I will be sure to buy more of the dinosaur fossil eggs because we're not going to see these anymore. Once they're out of game, they are out of game and people go crazy over them once the new egg releases but yeah make sure that you guys are picking up all of your fossil updates before they leave the game all right guys so that is going to be the end of this quick video i really hope that you guys enjoyed i have a really exciting video coming next which is a collab with a few of my friends and overlook Bay. so stay tuned for that make sure to go check out some of the new merch in my store i will have the links down below in my description box to the exact outfits because for some reason they are not showing up in my group but this is kind of just like a little mini clip of the new merch that is in my group we have our little donut suits that came from easter and i kind of revamped them to be like regular donut merch also make sure to hit that subscribe button so that you guys can become a donut i would really love for you guys to become part of our family because we have so many exciting things coming and so many live streams and stuff like that also make sure your notifications are enabled as well and i will see you guys in my next video bye